The European Union is offering to give up 18% of fish caught in UK waters but only after 10 years in the latest attempt from Michael Barnier to break the deadlock over the crucial red line in post-Brexit trade deal talks. The two negotiating teams remain locked in talks over a free trade agreement FTA, with little progress seemingly being made with less than four weeks to go until the end of the transition period. The EU's chief Brexit negotiator Mr Barnier is briefing the bloc's ambassadors this morning before yet another round of intense negotiations with the UK being. Tony Connolly, Europe editor for RTE in Ireland, has claimed the EU is attempting to make a breakthrough on the issue of fishing as time runs out to get a deal over the line but added the two sides still remain significantly apart. He tweeted, on fish, both sides are far apart, but it sounds like the UK wants the EU to jump first before it, in turn, shows flexibility. The UK is offering a three-year phase in but with an upfront payment of 300 million euros in demersal fish, i.e., out of the 650 million euros EU boats catch in UK waters. Then each year after the phase in there would be a link between EU boats getting access and a handover of stock. EU sources say this would be disastrous for EU boats. Demersal stocks are basically all the whitefish plus prawn, nephrops, that make up the most valuable EU share. The EU is proposing a 10-year phase in, at which point EU fleets would forego 18% of the value of what they catch now in UK waters. Then there would be a review. The UK is said to be insisting on 80%. Source says both sides are so far apart that meeting somewhere between 18% and 80% would not work. Access seems to be the battleground. This is where the UK is wielding the sovereignty tool. Deciding who has access to your waters will satisfy that sense of newfound sovereignty. The UK approach appears to be, we cannot start talking about access until we know how much fish quota EU boats will have in order to utilize that access. And if the Commission doesn't move from 18%, then we can't have that conversation. I am told the UK will show flexibility on the 300 million euros in access if the Commission makes that first move. On the EU side, there is still the option of linking UK access to the EU's lucrative energy market in exchange for fisheries access.